Hey guys, I'm back. Mike here. Mike's DVDs and Blu-rays collection is back. I'm trying to get this camera to be here. Uh, thought I would stop at a Dollar General store today on my way back from running some errands. I haven't done a, a Dollar General video in a long time, it seems like. Um, but actually found some interesting... Some interesting videos, I believe. Um... They had some older movies. Um, I don't have a lot of Joan Crawford movies. Um, I just recently got Johnny Guitar, which is one of my favorite westerns. Just, just a great western. Uh, she's really good in it. Um, but they had this one uh, DVD of Joan Crawford and John Garfield in humoresque. Um, that's a MGM movie from I think 1946. Yeah, 1946. Uh, it's really good. I like John Garfield a lot, too. He's uh, really good. It, it's more of a dramatic movie uh, where he's a uh, concert uh, violinist. And um, there's some really good scenes in there where uh, it shows him playing the violin, but he's actually being... Two other people are uh, playing it, actually. One, one is doing the, uh, the, uh, the neck on the strings, and then the other one is doing the bow. And they're kind of standing behind him and working the violin for him. So it's, it's a really cool uh, you know, special effect, uh, kind of a simple effect, actually, uh, done back then. So kind of interesting. I, I saw that in a documentary or something before, so um, I'm going to check that out in this plus you know 395 that's not too bad um i found this western I'm, I'm a huge fan of westerns anybody watches my channel should know this by now uh but i found this one movie this looks like an independent movie this is from uh i don't even know four digital media is the thing it's a you know made for video movie but it's called a fistful of lead and um doesn't really have anybody uh, starring in it that, you know, is a big name or anything. So, it looks like a really, you know, independent type movie. So, um, I'm going to see how they do. I mean, you know, with the title like A Fistful of Lead, it, it may be a throwback to a spaghetti type western or something. So, um, I'm hoping maybe it'll be good. But for two ninety five, you can't beat that. It's worth a try. If, if it's not very good, I'll sell it or trade it. So, um, A Fistful of Lead. Next up, I found a movie. This is a uh, Blu-ray. It's a um, it's another uh, independent movie. It says Rooster Teeth. It's called Blood Fest, and it's about a group of teenagers uh, going to a horror fan or a horror festival, like a, a movie, you know, fan fest type of thing. Um, and uh, the uh, person that's running the the show is uh he's got plans for these kids or apparently so it looks like a kind of an interesting you know independent type movie uh the throwback to you know throwback movies you know so um yeah i'll check it out it's got um it's got a bunch of young young people in it i don't know if rooster teeth if, if that's what that is exactly I guess that's the name of something. Rooster Teeth Bloodfest. So yeah, try that out. Again, if it's not any good, I'll, you know, sell it or trade it. Next up, there was a um, movie. Um, also like historical dramas, his you know historic stuff like war movies and Civil War type movies and stuff. I'm not like a big nut or anything, but. These were some movies that look really good. I mean, this is an epic movie here. It's called Gods and Generals. It's got Jeff Daniels, Stephen Lang, um, Robert Duvall. Uh, it's basically, he's, Robert Duvall plays Robert E. Lee in it. And uh, Jeff Daniels, I'm assuming, is uh, Grant. Oh, no, he's, uh, he's just a guy. Stonewall, Jack. I think that's who he is. Anyways, um, I've heard about this movie. This came out 
back in 2002. And I think this was, I don't know, was this made for, was this, a, this was, yeah, this was rented. This was out in the theaters. I'm, I'm trying to think if this was made for the TNT channel back in the day, but this was released at theaters. It's a, it's apparently, it's a prequel to um, Gettysburg, the Gettysburg massive two three part movie or whatever it was back in the day so pretty interesting i'm gonna check it out looks like it's well made and finally guys picked up a uh, one of these warner brothers uh four film favorite sets it's a really cool way to get some movies and th these are four movies i don't have so this is really interesting uh this is a uh, martial arts uh so yeah martial arts it's got a militant eagle um, bloody fists moonlight sword and jade lion and the prodigal boxer so some pretty cool uh, kung fu and I don't have already so there you go so I'll check that out and um, that's about it. So, guys, I uh, hope you liked the video. Um, if you haven't subscribed already, subscribe to my channel and hit that like button. And um, I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching.